Okay, so in this practice, the parent wants to increase parenting time. They found this statute, or the attorney representing, representing them found this statute. So I like to take the statute and put it in words so I can parse it out there. And if you do that, it's uh, pretty clear here what the elements are. So to get parenting time, you have to uh, show that it's in the best interest of the child. And then there's a sentence about a presumption which doesn't apply. Um, as in, it's just policy, it's not something you have to prove. But then it says, parenting time shall be granted. So here's a right to the parent in a frequency, duration, and type, that very much looks like elements, that promote a strong relationship between the child and parent. So those appear to be the, uh, the elements. Now, we have to make sure that we're not missing any sections. So to do that, you go broad. In Westlaw and Lexis, you click on Table of Contents. On the official website, it will often look something like this over here, where we're down here at the section, we need to go one up to the act that we're in, which is the Child Custody Act. And we were down here in 27A, parenting time. And so we want to start at the top and read down all of the different sections in the act to make sure we're not missing anything. And we notice right away the definition section is 722.22. But then look at this, 722.23, the best interests of the child defined. So the, the definition section doesn't really have much for us on point. But here is best interests defined. So if we had focused only on that 27A, we would have totally missed this. So here's all of these factors, the love and affection, the capacity of the parties involved to provide love, the length of, of time the child has lived in a stable environment, the moral fitness of the parties involved, and so forth. So these, there's all of these factors that you balance. So in addition to what we found in 27A, in the brief, you'd also need to balance these factors. So that is the answer to this. The main thing is when you're reading codified law, remember it's part of a bigger puzzle and you need to click on something to give you context to see those other pieces. All right, see you back in the book.